excited to co-host uh, this um, evening's celebration with SOAS, celebrating 100 years of SOAS. And this would be only the beginning of a very fruitful uh, collaboration between SOAS and the College of Humanities and Social Sciences in Hamad bin Khalifa University. This is Amal Malki, founding dean, College of Humanities and Social Sciences. Hi, I'm Valerie Amos. I'm the director of SOAS, and I'm absolutely delighted to be here in Doha celebrating our centenary. And I'd particularly like to thank uh, Dr. Malki and uh, the Hamad bin Khalifa University for co-hosting this evening with us. It's been a wonderful evening. So many of our alumni uh, in different roles who really are changing the world. And that's what we at SOAS do. We're a very, very special place and to be here and to have the opportunity to strengthen and deepen our partnerships with our alumni here in Qatar is a very special moment for us. So, what a wonderful evening. I'm delighted to have been a part of it. My name is uh, Hassan Hakimian and I'm the director of the London Middle East Institute at SOAS. It's my absolute honor and pleasure to be welcoming everybody here tonight to this very special event. One of the great things about being director of SOAS is that absolutely everywhere I go, um, our alumni speak um, warmly and passionately about their time at SOAS and uh, here in Qatar it's been uh, no different. This celebration comes as a prologue of a hopefully long and fruitful relationship between SOAS and the College of Humanities and Social Sciences. A relationship that takes it at its heart the common mission of both entities and building intercultural bridges that transcend geographical boundaries, focusing on the studies of languages and cultures and the fluidity. My name is Hassan Hakimian, I'm the director of the London Middle East Institute at SOAS, University of London. Uh, this is SOAS's centenary year. I guess uh, birthdays are always a special occasion and the birthday, 100th birthday or centenary of a remarkable institution like SOAS is even more special. SOAS is renowned globally for its expertise in the study of Asia, Africa, and the Middle East. In fact, Middle Eastern studies at SOAS has deep roots and a very long history, extending back all the way to the past century. It's especially pleasing for me to be able to celebrate this landmark for our university here in Qatar, thanks to generous sponsorship and co-hosting 
by a new dynamic university, uh, Hamad bin Khalifa University. I'm especially grateful to uh, the founding dean of the College of Humanities and Social Sciences, CHSS, Dr. Amal Al-Malki, who in fact herself uh, obtained her PhD from SOA, so she's a SOAS alumna. For us as an academic institution committed to the study of the Middle East, uh, we are very uh, committed to uh, promoting collaboration and cooperation. And this requires us to extend our hand of cooperation to new and dynamic institutions in the region such as HBKU and the College of Humanities and Social Sciences, which have very kindly hosted this very special event for us tonight. And we are so pleased to be in such good company. In fact, we look forward to the next 100 years working closely with partners in the entire region and in the state of Qatar. My name is Hamar Khuzai. I happen to be one of the very old graduates of SAWAS. And I am so happy to be here in Qatar for the centenary celebration. Tonight, I've met so many people, so many interesting people, mainly who were associated with this great University of London School of Oriental and African Studies. This is an occasion that gives you a bright idea to collaborate and uh, to make or renew friendship with people that you have known for so many years. And uh, I'm very glad that uh, SAWAS is collaborating with uh, the university here in Doha and joining hands for this great celebration. I am very grateful for both institutions for setting up this lovely dinner. Thank you.